right, I'm a, I'm a day off um, getting uh, testosterone. Um, so I wanted to do like a video so people could see like the changes in my voice and how my transition's going. Um, my friend said it were a good idea to do it, but I'm not too sure whether it is or not. But I'll let you guys uh, decide. I'm 29 um, and it's only been like the last few years I've started to transition. Um, I've changed my name legally uh, and I'm waiting for my first uh, gender appointment. Um, but I'm getting put on bridging hormones, which is amazing. Um, so obviously there's a massive wait um, for the gender clinic at the minute in England, um, which obviously is frustrating for quite a lot of trans men. I'm going to do these videos and you can see what you think, see whether they're rubbish or see if they're helpful or not. Um, when, once I've got my appointment through uh, for the gender clinic, um, I'll be looking at getting the assessment uh, to make sure that I'm sure about transitioning, which I am. Um, so I want top surgery and bottom surgery, um, but obviously that's going to be years in the making. Um, so between now and then, obviously I'll start bridging hormones and uh, checking my levels and things like that. So tomorrow I'll get my bloods taken, um, I'll get weighed, and then they'll start me on testosterone um, through endocrinology uh, in Bradford. So I'll let you guys see what you think and see whether this video is helpful or not. Um, let me know if there's any feedback or anything like that. Um, I'm a bit nervous about doing it, so I'm hoping that you all find it uh, helpful. And if you don't, then then that's cool. <laughs> um, but yeah, I'll hopefully do more of these videos. Um, you can just let me know on your thoughts and feelings. And if there's any ways that I can help to support you, or if you feel like you're on your own, you're not. Um, but transitioning is quite a lonely kind of uh, period i'm well aware of that so i'll see you guys soon um and i hope you get something from these videos bye